Hey guys, it's CJ here, otherwise known as Jersey Who 90 um, As you might be able to see here, just the just in frame. I have three boxes in today, which is good. I have a Luke Crate, I have a Junior Girls and a Nerblock. A Junior Nerblock Girls and a Nerblock. Woo! So, yeah. So that's cool, that's good. Uh, that's three less that have arrived before, that's three of them. No wait, what arrived yesterday? Oh, the collector's got some Marvel. So that means four out of the boxes that do this, uh, that I've got this box have arrived. So that's good. Um, now, what I have decided to do is leave the junior girls until the junior boys shows up because. I think it's just easier for me to do them as one video because it's easier to compare them then. And if this is and if it's a disappointment, then at least you get the disappointment over in one go rather than having to wait for the next one and have to film another video even though you know you're not gonna like what's in it. So I'm gonna leave this one until the boys come. So yeah. Because I like comparing them. It's easier to compare anyway. It's better. I find I get them done quicker and more efficiently if I unbox them together. So that's what I'm going to do with that one. So I'm going to put that one down there and not count that one. <laughs> I will open it tomorrow. So what leaves these that? So now it just leaves a loot crate and a nerblock to open today. Woo. So which one should I start with? Should I start with loot, loot crate or nerblock? Um, I don't know what to start with actually. <laughs> um, the positives are, I don't really know. Um, I don't know what the theme of this is. I have, is it Galaxy or something? I don't know. Whatever. Um, and I can't remember the theme of this one either. Um, I think this one's Galaxy for some reason. And I'm not sure about this one. Uh, hmm. Eeny meeny. I don't know. What? Well, how do we decide this? Um, weight. They're both about the same weight, actually. Um, eeny meeny miny. Let's go with loot crate first, <laughs> um, since that's on top. Oh, sis man. So I just had a um. little bit of a drama. Well, not drama as such. A series of un of events. Um, I went to get, well, I realised I didn't have any scissors. So, and just at that same point, the battery decided to die. So, I went to look for my battery. I went and found my charger, which should contain the spare battery in the charger. But nope, the charge the charge was there, but no spare battery. So I'm like, where on earth is that? It should be in the charger where I left it. Turns out I found it on the floor under the dining room table. Don't know how it got there. All I can think of is that it fell off of where I had it and the battery fell out. Someone picked it up and put it back, but didn't realise the battery was there. It was supposed to be in it. So anyway, I don't know what happened there. Then I couldn't find the scissors. <laughs> So then once I put the battery back in the cupboard, I just sat down again and realised I haven't, still haven't got the scissors. So I went back to the scissors and I can't find the scissors. So I had to, I found this pair though. So that's alright. But yeah, mental. Anyway, now I shall get on with the loot crate. Uh, oh my god, these scissors are terrible. This is why I usually want, I need to invest in a knife. Like a razor knife. There we go. To cut these boxes because it's so much easier. Right, I'm gonna move that slightly and hope I can fit. Nah. Ooh. Look, I haven't. I just opened up to that point and it says loot crate, and here it says, what does it say? Flip me inside out. Woo. 
Anyway, we won't do that because we don't want to see what's in it. So, right, there is a t-shirt on the top. So, let's pull the t-shirt out then. But, ooh. Right, okay, this does fit in with the theme Galaxy so far. I think, what is this? Um... Oh, that's really cool! I'm going to wear that on Christmas Day. That is awesome. It's like <laughs> a Christmassy. It's so long, I'm going to have to just do this gradually. So, it is. You have. It's like a snow jumper thing. It's like. A Christmas jumpery mashupy thing. So it's like a Christmas because it's like got all the things are. Uh, I'm not sure any of the references to it. That one. Like, okay. So starting from the top, there is the surface of what looks like Mars and Moon. Christmas snowflakes along the top there. You've got that spaceship thing that I'm not sure where that's from. You've got all the planets lined up along there, which looks cool. Then you've got more of the snowflakey design. Then you've got tank uh, thing, a uh, ground army sort of trucky thing looks like. Could be, probably it's from a thing and I can't tell, and a snowman. Um, then at the bottom you've got little rockets or little spaceships at the bottom and it's all got this whole snowy effect to it. So it looks like a Christmas jumper. I don't know if I hold it like that whether you can see it or not because I can't see it over my head. There, that's better. Okay, you can see it just about there. If I think, if I hold it like that. But yeah, look how awesome that is. That's really cool. Hope you could get all that in one shot there. But yeah, I won't know until I edit it. But yeah, that is awesome. That is a cool shirt. I love it. I really love it. That's awesome. Awesome, awesome. And that's a Loot Crate one? That's amazing for a Loot... That's just really cool. Good, I'd expect some... Rainspun. I'd expect something that cool. I'd expect that to be a Nerd Block t-shirt. That's really surprised me that that is... That, that is um, from a loot crate, because I honestly would have expected something more... It's not the style of, of, some, of stuff that loot crate have done before, but I really love it. It's really cool. I would really expect that... that it, yeah, it would have been something I would have definitely expected from Nerdblock, so interesting. But it's cool. I love it. That's an awesome shirt. I'm wearing that on Christmas Day. That's my new Christmas shirt. I'm gonna put that there. Right. Next. Oh my god, there's just a big thing. Oh, this doesn't feel good. Oh, that's the end of the box again. Oh my god, there's just like this big tin thing that's covering up the whole of the thing. I have to. Yes, it does cover up the whole thing. I'm just gonna pull it out then. Literally, that was. This was in it. This thing. I'm just intrigued to see. Right, there's still a couple more things in the bottom there. I think they've put more of the loot inside this thing just to fill it in somehow. So let's just pull this out. This is, yeah, that's the Loot Crate magazine. I, that's what I thought it was. So Loot Crate magazine. We'll look at that afterwards. Um, what else is in here? There's a card. Okay. What is this? Xbox One. Oh, game item. That doesn't interest me. Um, right. So there is a Halo Five Guardians code to get um, to get an item, a download an item for Xbox One. I don't have an Xbox One, so that's useless to me, and I don't really have any interest whatsoever in Halo. So there you go. Now I think, now 
I take it the rest of the loot is in here because there's nothing else in the box. So, um, yeah. So, I take it there's more stuff in this lunchbox thing. So, because let's say I'd be very disappointed if it's just a game code for an item and the t-shirt and this. So I'm taking there's more stuff in it. <laughs> um, so yeah. But so we'll start with the tin since that is obviously the thing. So it's a Halo 5 Guardians lunchbox which is really actually pretty cool. You've got the um, the logo from it. I can't remember. Oh that's what that says. United Nations Space Command logo there which is cool. Um, you got Halo 5 Guardians on the side on either side and it's just like this cool little um, it's like a um, I don't know um, it's just like a thing I like a carry case thing you know Um, uh, like, and like, I'm trying to think what I'm trying to explain it is. It looks like army ish, is that what I'm trying to say? You know, like, it would contain, like, it, it looks like a, like, a sort of storage container that you would carry stuff around in. Is that what makes sense? Anyway, I'm just going to open it and see what else is in here. Because that's just a lunchbox. It's really cool, though. But I don't know if I'm that into it, but what's just it? Oh! I opened it and I can instantly tell what's in it. There is two things in it. Oh, and there's something else stuck down the side. But there's a pop. Look, pop. And it says on the top from the new film Star Wars. So, yeah. And we have some socks down the side. And they're really cool. They're all right. I like those. Um, the whole Star Wars thing still going. Still talking about Star Wars. But, hey. Um... These are cool because they're BB-8 socks and I rather like BB-8, he's so cute. So yeah, they're Loot Crate exclusive socks too. But yeah, so that's cool. The last pair of Loot Crate exclusive socks I had, I got a hole in them because I went down a slide, I think, and the, I think the slide destroyed them. But when I got home, there was a great big hole in the bottom. So I'm like, either there, either there was a bad pair of socks or that slide, or it was the slide's fault. I haven't figured out, but yeah. So I haven't worn a pair of Loot Crate socks ever since. Um, but not that's not intentional, of course. It's just I haven't, never. I just put them to the side and kept forgetting to wear them. Oh, I found the badge down the bottom. Oh, it is Galaxy, the famous Galaxy. There you go. Loot Crate. Oh, it's got Serenity on it. <coughs> no it doesn't, that's a complete lie. It's got some sort of thing on it, I don't know. Can you see that? <coughs> I'm sorry. But yeah, that thing. It's cool, that's an alright badge, it's a badge. Right, now I'm going to get the pop over with because it's sort of blocked whatever the other thing is it has is <coughs> in. If that made any sense to you, sorry. I suddenly had a choking fit. Suddenly got a choking fit. Right, so we have <coughs> a look great exclusive, of course. Um, uh, so Han Solo normally comes with a gun. That's useful to know. Uh, he's still got his gun. So I take it that's not. What's exclusive about them? Different clothes. Oh, he's in his snow gear. Okay, that's cool. So that's a cool one. That's a new crate exclusive. That's nice. Um, so we have a Star Wars. Oops, sorry, that was a bit. I forgot I had the camera so close. We have a Star Wars pop Han Solo in his snow gear, which is cool, and it's a loot crate exclusive, which is awesome. That is really cool. That's pretty cool. I like that. That's pretty awesome. You can see him there. 
It's really cool. I don't know what the difference is between this one and... Well, yeah, it's the snow gear. I don't know if the gun is slightly different. It's hard to tell from the glam shot. It's hard to tell from the back, but... Hey, that's cool. I like that. That's awesome. Um, so, what is the other thing we have in here, then? It is a Galaxy Quest emblem patch. Loot Crate exclusive. Yes, that is it that's in there. So this document certifies prop representative of a Galaxy Quest emblem patch was created by Quantum Mechanics Incorporated under license from Paramount Pictures and Loot Crate. Oh, exclusively for Loot Crate and there's again the two signatures. Um, what's Galaxy Quest? Is it a Star Trek? Is it a Star Trek thing? I don't know. But it's really cool, look, it's a patch, basically. And that's what it looks like. That's awesome. That's really cool. It's got in this little nice folder thing. So that's really awesome. I like that. I'm not 100% sure where it's from, but it's a cool patch. Um, that ship looks like a ship that could be in Star Trek, that's all I'm saying. I don't know if I'm completely wrong, but... Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. But anyway, that's cool. Um, I haven't really heard, I've heard of Galaxy Quest, but I don't know what it is. So yeah, there you go. Um, I'm going to look at the book quickly to see what we got. Um, this one's loot, the Galaxy Pin. Wow. Wow. You really had a whole page to go just to the pin? Okay. So, going through this anyway. So this one's like, we had the good pin. Ooh, that was a nice sound. We have the exclusive Han Solo pop in his snow gear, which is cool. Oh, they're bubbleheads? I didn't know that. Well, I probably did. Actually, I did, because R2-D2, which I have, is a bubble pop. A bubble pop? A pop thing. Um, exclusive, yeah, exclusive. So then we had the awesome t-shirt, which I'm just going to show you a picture of here instead of showing you the actual t-shirt. But yeah, look at that. Then you might be able to see it in better detail. But yeah, look how awesome that is. That's really cool. Um, we have the platch and the, we have the exclusive pop. The exclusive patch and the exclusive socks, BB-8 socks, which are cool. Um, what do you call a Star Trek movie that's not a Star Trek movie? Why Galaxy Quest, of course. Linked is one of the best Star Trek movies in the franchise. We celebrate its fandom with an authentic pop record patch like one of the featured on the film's command uniforms. Ah, so I was sort of right, I was right about the Star Trek. That ship did look like a Star Trek ship, and it was. So there you go. Uh, then we had the lunchbox, the Halo lunchbox, and the Halo game code thing. Oh, it's a wreck pack, apparently. But yeah. So that's it. That's Loot Crate for you. Um, it's actually pretty cool. It's actually an alright one. It's actually, it's good. It's good. It's, um, one of the best ones. Um, last month's I thought was a bit meh, was I think, was it last month's? Was a bit meh, was a bit on the, f was, con was okay, you know. Oh yeah, it was the fighter cop, fighter, wasn't it, last month. And that was a bit meh for me because of, yeah, not know it because of, yeah, just not a theme I particularly like. But 
Galaxy is a theme that I like. Um, it should have been. I would have. I like. I would like to see more Star Trek items in these when they do Galaxy. I'd like to see more Star Trek, but and yeah, it's one of those. Star Wars is the big thing this month, and is a big thing for the last couple of months. So obviously, everyone's excited about the new movie and all that. So obviously, we we're bound to get Star Wars in a Galaxy box. And the BB-8 socks are cool, and we have a cool exclusive pop. I'm never bothered about these. When I get an exclusive pop, I'm happy. So, yeah. And the lunchbox is really cool. It's a cool little thing. So, yeah. And the batch is, the batch is really cool. And the t-shirt is amazing, though, and I love it. So, yeah. Um, anyway, I'm going to go now because I have 36 seconds left on the camera. And I uh, don't think I've got any more to say, really. I will be back in a minute with a no block. So, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!